Hello again, good friends, and welcome back to the channel. Brian from Apex Detail here. I hope everybody is staying safe and is not going crazy from being pent in from this long period of time. I hope we are all able to get back at it soon. I'm trying to keep you entertained in the meantime, and uh, so we'll start a short series here. This will be probably a two or three video series on correction of heavy swirling on black uh, clear coat. It's going to be hard clear coat, and I'm going to be introducing three new products throughout the videos, so you will want to stay tuned. Hate wasting your time, so let's get this started. Working on an eight or nine year old five series BMW, this is when the clear coat on these was harder, a little bit more stubborn. As we get newer into the newer models, they're getting softer and softer, just like anything else. And you can see even with the hard stubborn clear coat, what type of imperfections, swirling and scratches we have to remove. Now there is plenty of clear coat to work with and I will show you that. So we will use the LVR305 Wonder Cut that removes 1000 to 1200 grit sand marks. And we're gonna use the LVR Ice to finish up. So it's gonna be a two part system or a uh, two part correction. Extreme Solutions has numerous polishes and compounds to get the job done, depending on what you're working on. And as we take measurements, we have plenty of material, plenty of clear coat here to work with. Normally something this uh, age with the miles that are on it would have somewhere between five and a half to seven and a half mils, depending. As you can see, the gloss is also very low. So that's where I could pull out the 305 Wonder Cut when we have plenty of clear to work with and a lot of deep imperfections to remove. We'll set the LVR367 ice to the side right now and just concentrate on the Wonder Cut. We'll team that up with the rotary and a Lake Country low lint pre wash lamb's wool pad. The perfect combination if you have these types of imperfections. The Wonder Cut was formulated to remove sand marks, oxidation, water spots, and many other deep imperfections and will probably be used mostly in a two or more stage correction as this will be the cutting portion and will need to be finished down from here. Always pick out a little spot, it's mostly in an inconspicuous area, but for the video purposes I have to do to up here on the hood where we can mask a little area off and test what we have picked out, the combination of pad, polisher, and correction fluid to see if it matches the imperfections and the clear coat that we're working on. So I have the rotary here set on between the third and fourth speed setting. Pressure is always going to be, you know, equivalent to a firm handshake for me, which is kind of light, only using my thumb as pressure down on top of the polisher. And we're doing a crisscross pattern, keeping the polisher as flat as possible. You can work the LVR305 for as long as you need it to. It has a nice, impressive cycle time. Dusting when you're using the rotary is noticeable. Uh, very little if you're using the DA. Using a rotary and a wool pad, the wool fibers clean themselves as the polisher's spinning. So you always will have a little bit more dirt to contend with using a rotary. But it cuts so fast, and I love to use it. So that's what we are cutting with today. To remove the masking tape, I'll grab you guys, bring you in close, and you can already see the difference, and this is just the cutting portion. This is fantastic turnaround. If I need to, I can make another pass. And if you're wondering why it looks so nice and clear, it does need to be finished down. There is a little bit of hazing there, but if you were on softer clear coat, guys, there would be a lot more haze with something this gritty used to cut. Um, I'm using my correction light here. This is fantastic from Eastwood. I'll try to remember to put a link down below, but as you can see, we have a nice turnaround just from the cutting portion and wait till we grab the ice and finish it down. This color will look fantastic. Very anxious to see what this is gonna look like corrected. I went ahead and cut the entire hood. So let me grab you and bring you in closer. And again, after the first step, it's looking amazing already. And the clarity's coming out. You can see my reflection in high detail. 
So that's what we're going to use to go all the way around this vehicle and do some cutting. The side of the 5 Series here has even more scratches and swirls indicative of running through a car wash with the wraps just doing a huge number grinding on that clear coat. Perfect? No, there are some imperfections that run through the clear coat and some that are almost through and just are not worth chasing after. We're going to leave as much clear coat as possible as this vehicle has a ton of miles to go on the PA roadways here. Making progress quickly, we have the entire front clip of the 5 Series finished already. Just like the passenger side, the driver's side has scratches and swirls running all the way back through from the front fender to the rear quarter panel, but we are taking care of them. That will do it for the cutting portion, and since that's through, before we go to the next step, and I can show you there are no fillers in the LVR305, we're going to use Oil Zero from Tax Systems. This is primarily, for me, used for removing any type of residue in between the correction process. Using the shop light on the other side of the hood, you'll be able to see no imperfections were unveiled. It's what you see is what you get with the LVR305 Wondercut. And that will bring us to the final thoughts segment of the video. The cutting portion of the correction is finished. Tomorrow we can move on with the polishing portion. Speaking of the cutting uh, portion of the correction, the LVR305, the Wondercut has done a fantastic job. It's done everything we ask it to. Removing harsh imperfections on that hard clear coat and that's not an easy job um, so when it comes to price uh, 16 and change starting with the pint there's three different sizes you can order all the way up to 56.95 for a whole gallon of the stuff only one tiny drawback is just a little bit of dusting you can work the product for a long period of time it's very effective and we're going to keep using our rating scale here in the final segment portion of the video what will this get? Well, this is very impressive, and that's what it'll get from me when it comes to our rating scale. If you have any questions so far, don't hesitate to ask. This has been Brian from Apex Detail. I'll catch you in the next segment of this series.